applause to our faculty members who are here with us today, all teachers, members of the faculty. A round of applause to all of the students who are part of this extended SGI family. Thank you and welcome as we take the opportunity today to celebrate and give thanks in this our first annual, it's going to be annual, our first annual Thanksgiving service. God has been good to us as a community, as a family, as an organization. God has indeed been good to us, and today is about celebrating his goodness. The theme, celebrating God's faithfulness with great expectation for the future. That's what this is about. My job is not to take too much time or give too much of the formalities, just to welcome you to the St. George's Bible Holiness Church. That's the name of this church. Um, it is the home church of Mrs. Purcell, Miss Antoine, myself, and so forth. Um, and it is very much a partner and a part of the extended SGI community. So we want to thank you and ask you to feel welcome, relax, comfortable as you go through today. I want to begin, as we always do and we should do, with a word of prayer. Everything we do, we want God to take charge and we want God to lead. And so at this time, I'll invite one of the students, Form 5 student, Prefect Annalise Bromfield Bishop, to lead us in prayer. Can we all stand, please, as we... Let us pray. As we gather here in the harbor of your safety, we thank you for fellowship and family. We ask that you will strengthen us, restore us, and inspire us with your love. Lord, will you fill us with your peace so that as we journey onwards, we will pour out your love and grace to others. We ask that our souls would catch the winds of your spirit so that we would take your promises to all the earth. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Annalise. Please remain standing. We're still at school. It is still school, and so we're going to do our duty to country. I'll invite one of our students, another one, Giovanna Hostialik, to lead us in the national anthem. ourselves to thee. Heads, hearts, and hands in unity to reach our destiny. Ever conscious of God, being proud of our heritage, may As one people, one family, God bless our nation. Thank you very much, Giovanna. You can be seated. Thank you and welcome to those who are coming in. Very, very happy to have you. Today is all about giving thanks. Today is all about us as a family, as a community, as an institution. So all that is done on the program today will be done, will be offered by members of the SGI community. At this time, I'd like to invite to give the welcome address to welcome you to today's Thanksgiving service. Form 5 student, Deputy Head Boy, Adley Debellot Louison. Welcome all to the inaugural anniversary service of the St. George's Institute. This service will be focused on thanking God for his faithfulness to our institution, especially in such a time like this. this the, he has allowed us to succeed in numerous ways. 
Just to highlight a few, academically, we have had several students complete the CSEC examinations within the first year. Physically, the school has grown tremendously since its commencement in 2020, going from an original 30 students to now having 105. As a school, we promote holistic development, so we were pleased to facilitate a fun day last year and a sports meet this year, along with competing in the most recent intercollegiate games. We are forever, we are forever grateful to God for the countless blessings bestowed upon our school. Indeed, there were many challenges, but God has kept us. Scripture reminds us to give thanks in all circumstances. Therefore, let us give thanks. Thank you and enjoy. Thank you very much, Deputy Head Boy Adley de Bellot Guizan. Holistic development is what we are all about. Today's ceremony is very much a part of that. It's a Christian school and we are built on a Christian foundation. Everything flows from our Christian foundation. I'll invite at this time, as we get set for worship service, scripture says, the scripture says, make a joyful noise unto the Lord. And that's what we're going to do. As we try to celebrate and give thanks, we want to offer our praises, our singing, our voices, our... Bear in mind, you don't have to have the best voice in the world, but I have a brother who used to say, my brother who is no governor, he used to say, I can't sing. That's him, I think I can sing, but he used to say, I can't sing. But something about when the praises go up and it mix with the air, and by the time they get to heaven, it's sounding sweet. That's what he used to say. So the idea is, feel free to participate and, and get involved. There's no right or wrong. Well, there is a right key, but there's no right or wrong way to express yourself once it's nice and decent and in order. So I'll invite Letitia Brown to do the scripture reading, followed by Miss Antoine, who will lead us in praise and worship. Letitia Brown, Deputy Head Girl. The scripture reading for today is taken from 1 Samuel chapter 7, verses 12. And then Samuel took a stone and set it up between Mizpah and Shen, and called his name Ebenzer, saying, Thus far the Lord has helped us. Amen. Shall we stand, please? Everybody, up, up, up. We are about to give God thanks and praise. He has been good. Bless his name. Hallelujah. We are about to sing and make a joyful noise unto the Lord. Oh yeah, we're excited this morning. We're excited. We, in a time like this, we are taking the time out to say, God, thank you. And so we thank you. Let us give thanks. Let's go. <laughs> so you clap your hands and you get in gear and you just enjoy the atmosphere. Okay? Nothing will harm you here this morning. Give God our best this morning. Yeah? And if you don't know but you can just clap. You can just move from side to side. That's okay. What can I render to Jehovah? For he has done so very much for me. What can I render to Jehovah? For he has done so very much for me. Sing it with me. What can I render to Jehovah? For he has done so very much. What can we render this morning? What can I render to Jehovah? For he has done so very much for me. Oh 
give you thanks. Let's sing it together.
you have been truly good to us as an institution. Lord, we give thanks. Bless his name. You give God a clap offering. He has been good. We give him thanks this morning. We give him thanks. Lord, you are good and your mercies endure forever. We give you thanks. Bless his name. We give you thanks. All right, thank you so much to Miss Antoine. You may be seated. Hopefully you were given the opportunity or you had the opportunity or you used the opportunity to give thanks. To give thanks. It's an internal something when your soul fills up and you're so overwhelmed with the goodness and the mercy and the provision and the blessing that it just naturally flows out. That's what giving thanks is all about. It's one thing that we must ensure we do is have an attitude of gratitude. Today we are celebrating God's faithfulness, celebrating God's faithfulness with great expectation for the future. We move the program right along, and this time I'll invite another one of our students to do a tribute in poem. I'd like to invite one of our very, very senior ones, Iyama Moore. Come on up, Iyama, and give your tribute in poem. really does fly, another year gone by, and as she I, we're waiting to fly high. We've had ups and downs, shed many smiles as well as frowns, but with God we prevail and meet the goal without fail. Thank you so much. A round of applause for Yama, please. <laughs> Yama was one of our very, very, very first. That's what they call an OG, you know, when you say OG, Yama was. Um, so she's literally grown up with us as an institution, as a family. Um, and so for her, she probably feels as much or just as overwhelmed as we as teachers feel, as, as faculty, as administrators, having seen the school grow up, if you will, over the course of this last year and a half. Thank you so much to Yama. That was a tribute from our student. It's a big community, it's a big family, everybody's involved. As the saying goes, it takes a village to raise a child. So it's not just the teacher, not just the parent, not just the classmate, every single body. It takes a village to raise a child. As this opportunity I'd like to give to a parent um, who's going to provide a tribute in song. This parent is going to invite our two children with her. Um, we'd like to invite Mrs. Isaac as one of our parents. Give her a round of applause. And she will be joined by Candice and Zena, two of our students who are very much involved. And they're going to share this one. No? No? Okay. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. So thankful, thankful to, to be a part, be a part of, of this celebration, celebration of, of the, the St. George's, George's Institute, Institute, where my, where daughter, my daughter came, came in, 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 one of the, one of the students, students being in the first, first batch. batch, batch, batch. We, we were, were it was, it was um, how it happened. It, happened. It, it was short it was notice. Short I think it was just about a week or so before 
before school, school reopened, reopened. I, was I was trying to get, to get her, her transferred, transferred to another, to another school, school, which, which they, they did not did allow. Not allow. But, um, but, um, Thank God Thank that SGI opened, SGI opened its arms, arms and, and welcomed, welcomed us, and us we are very, very thankful, thankful as well. As well. God is God indeed is good. You know, sometimes, sometimes when you're praising God, God the, devil the devil wants to put certain things, things, you know, in the way to, way to cause you to, to become, because I'm, I'm nervous, so I think so maybe I think it's maybe allowing, allowing me an opportunity, opportunity to settle to myself, so that, so that um, um, you know, you things know, can things flow, can flow smoothly. smoothly. But God, but God is, is indeed is good, good, and he is amazing.
One, two, three, four, five. All right. Thank you so much um, to the Isaac family, to our technicians as well. Thought I would have seen Zena as well, but very nice too. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> this is Isaac <laughs> and Candice. Um, really is a family feel at SGI. Everybody must be involved. Auntie, uncle, nene, everybody must be involved. That's the whole idea. We continue along. Um, we have talent among our students, among our parents, and among our teachers as well. So this time I want you to sit back and take in an instrumental on the keyboard, music teacher, Mr. Atiba Benoit. Mr. Benoit, over to you. If you know it, you can hum along, you know.
Tima Benoit. It was Mr. Tiba Benoit on the keyboard. Um, it's not a show, so we can't say encore on these things, but um, 